Next question. <laughs> <laughs> I think I like my card idea. Right? I and I'm like, what is this? Yeah. Ooh, is dating your friend's ex off limits? Yes, the hell it let's is. Let's go, let's go. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Can we start with uh, that? Uh, You're so quiet over there. What do you think? I, I couldn't. I could never do that. Even if they say it's okay? No, that's just fate. I feel like they would tell you, it's fine. They yeah, just you can go deal with my ex. It'll be fine. And then she'll do it. I'm like, uh, I don't think that's just something that we would do to each other. Like that if you were a friend or if you truly cared for me, you wouldn't do that. What if they've moved on to someone else? Who, my ex? No, no friend. your friend. friend is like totally married to someone else. And this ex is just floating in the breeze. Yeah. That's just weird. <laughs> yeah, I feel like that's you don't weird. you don't share spit. Like to me, yeah. that's just <laughs> like I could never. I could never. That is like well, an automatic no. Yeah. yeah, like I would it's not something that would ever cross now, my mind. I would just always associate my friend's ex as my friend's ex. That's uh, Wait, although if it was someone that they just like hooked up with She said although so there's it might be different if they were in like a serious relationship and but like, like could you fuck somebody you know that your friend fucked wouldn't you be like oh i wonder if she did this i wonder if like, <laughs> yeah i wonder if he touched her yeah like that's weird yeah, yeah i don't think i did it hard no i don't know i can't i have a friend that did that to some, and now yeah. you're all the friends. Oh. No, we're friends still. No. Um, she's not with him anymore. Shocking. Surprise. Uh, I feel like in high school. No, it wasn't no. in high school. <laughs> we were adults. But, <laughs> we were adults. Yeah, and I like I didn't care because I had zero feelings for this guy. Like it was, I was so far past that. But I thought it was weird for her to still do that. I, because like I said, I would be like, if I was in her shoes, I'd be like. Oh, I wonder if like weird. Kristen did this to him, or like I yeah. wonder if like what we're doing was what they did. It, I don't know. I just yeah. I, I I would. That's where my brain immediately goes. Oh okay. And yeah. I'm so competitive. I would just have to. <laughs> <laughs> no, I just I just couldn't do it. Like it just wouldn't be. I think it's a I think that's a female thing. Talking to some like of my guy friends, and I would ask like, why is it so easy for men to share women, but when it comes to girls, we're like absolutely not. Yeah, it's because I think men dudes will be like, yeah, sure, go ahead, I'm done with that, you can have it. Yeah. Like amongst they each other. Do it the you same think? way. Yeah. Guys, yes, I have seen girls go through a whole. They've gone through a whole like, roster of guy Literally. friends, like serious relationships. But, but, but I was At gonna, least two of the rock of the guy Jody's work. Can I can I just interject quickly? What what if okay, let me let me throw a little screw in here for you guys. If the guy isn't attracted to you, but let's say he was nice to you and he mm -hmm. dated you and he was treating you well, that whoever you're dating and they treated you well, um, but then you were like, eh, I wasn't really attracted to that person. Then does that change if you wanted to date that person? Your friend wanted to date him? Because you didn't really care. That's to funny with. you say that because uh, for me, it depends on if it was a relationship or not. Like, I went on one date with a guy, didn't even kiss him, nothing happened. And I actually was like, you know what? I feel like he'd get along really well with my girlfriend. <laughs> and I hooked them up. It didn't, nothing came from it. But, like, for me, that's, like, a lot. Like, because nothing happened with us. I, yeah, but it was very cordial. Like you guys, like, yeah, didn't yeah. Any like if I was in a full out committed relationship with someone, that would be so weird. What if you broke up with them in a bad way? What if it was a bad breakup? Well, then, you're not, you're not then your girlfriend heart. shouldn't be so no, stupid. Right? Yeah. You yeah. broke her heart, right? So yeah. you wouldn't want to yeah. stab your friend in the back by being like, oh, I know he was such a jerk, but look who I'm with. Yeah, Can you come to our family for lunch or something? Jerk to you, but he's great to me. I don't know what happened. But that could be the case. That could be the case. Well, this would have to jeopardize your friendship, and then you got to pick. It was more important. Yeah. This question is very, again, straight related because when the community is very large, there's a lot of dick to choose from if you're straight women. So there really would be no excuse. Yeah, there's when so you go to other pockets where it's smaller, <laughs> there are. It's not easy to not end up dating a friend or someone in your social circle because. If there's like a 10% population, then like in your Toronto, it's even smaller. So 
Yeah, and I wrote you, like so you and, uh, would date your friends ex? It's been done, but it's because the community is so so small. <laughs> and I'm talking about like with women. Yeah. There's like how many lessons to choose from? Not that many. So if you date one and all of a sudden you're in a party, like, oh, remember her? Yeah, I slept with her too. Cool, high five. And you dance. Some girls. And there's no animosity. Not really, no, because there's an understanding that between like a 7 billion population, there's like a small percentage of females to choose from. Then you're like in Toronto, so it's concentrated. Yeah, it's very, yeah. Yeah. It's very cool. different, it's but like straight girls like, no man, fuck this bitch. Yeah. And then they want to slice and dice you on the floor of sugar daddies, right. okay? But it's very different because there's all this like ownership. I don't know, between the males and females that I know in my community, does it, there is some drama sometimes, mm -hmm. but not but that's at good, that's a different perspective, that's good. Mm -hmm. Completely. Yeah. yeah. Wow. I'd still cut one of my friends. <laughs> <laughs> wow! Dang. See, I told you, stab, 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 across the table. <laughs> like, it, it actually reminds me of, like, going back to when we did have less options, like, when dating apps didn't exist. Like, you have this smaller pool of people to pick from. And when you lived in, like, a smaller, Timbuktu. smaller city. Like, yeah. Even just in university. Yeah. Like, when you were in residence, I went to Windsor, and yeah. the... There's a lot of sharing that might have gone on. Yeah. <laughs> you're like sharing. in one building, right? And it's what is your, your demographic? You're there for four years, like, oh my right. god, been there, done that. You can have a turn yeah. because it's what are you choosing from? Yeah, really. Yeah, yeah. that's so. I guess it guess all depends on where you are with your circumstances yeah, sure. and demo and geographically. Yeah. Make a huge difference. yeah, but are you referring to just like hookups with individuals? Are you talking? No, but even like you look up and you date the same thing. It's like if you're in in school and what are you choosing from? Is the same person that my friend might have from like last semester in psychology class, and now I'm in chemistry. It's like, oh man, there's now we have some chemistry, but it's awkward. <laughs> but you're, it's really small to choose from. I gotta like go outside and go to London. When that's like over an hour and a half from where I went to school, so it, uh, it, sometimes circumstances can make it yeah, different. Yeah, that makes I sense. That. Mm -hmm. I I don't think I'd ever date ever ever date a friend's ex, but I get that perspective yeah, now. It can, that it depends. You, so so let me ask yeah. you this question again. Throw another wrench in there. If you didn't know, <laughs> you and your wrenches. If you didn't know, and you ended up dating somebody that your friend dated, is that a, would you stop? Do you go oh, because of our friendship? I'm gonna stop, or would you? I would never not know. Because I know people that. <laughs> What if it's somebody you know that you hate? Like you hate the guy or the girl? Like the person that's that supposed to be your friend? No, no, no. It's not a friend. It's somebody that you, you hate, but you're dating their yeah, person. Yeah, their ex. Yeah. Yeah, their ex. Yeah. That's a good if question. If I hate a girl and my ex is dating her. No, you that? dated her ex. You hate the girl, you but you're dating her, her ex. So who cares? I'm sitting on the same step. What if you be like... Like, wouldn't you look at I'm like, like, ew, why are you have your that? Yeah. <laughs> no. Honestly, I'm I think what you would do I... is you should look at yourself and be like, how is it I hate this girl, but both of us have the same taste in men? <laughs> okay. Maybe yeah. something's yeah. wrong with the two of us. Yeah. Okay. Maybe I don't yeah. hate her all that much. Yeah. Maybe her, her and I actually have a lot in common. Right? For any... I've never actually hated a person in my life, but if I hated oh, someone... No, like, <laughs> my <laughs> you. <laughs> <laughs> No, but if I, I don't know, it depends on the reason you hate them. No, I wouldn't care. If I didn't, if I didn't have that person as a friend in my life, then I don't care. Yeah, I feel like, they, I feel like if they're not in my direct circle, like, if I don't know you and, like, I don't, my girlfriend dated you and I don't know, like, you didn't exist. Like, I yeah, think, like yeah. we would just know, like, it's... Just, it wouldn't even be I feel in like your it's girl mind. code. Like I would just know. Like, yeah. Yeah, that right. girl code is different than the bro code, which is why it's like men are so easy to be like, yo, man, go, yo, have a take, man. Yeah. And, and women are blowing my brain. So I'm like, how are you guys? Just... <laughs> I'm shocked by that because I feel like when men are committed, they're the more emotional ones. I feel like they're men right. are like, if she's for she's right. the bros, then. We can all share. Mm. Just go ahead, have her. Let me know. I, yeah, I feel committed. like that no. when they're not committed. Yeah. Like when a guy yeah. commits, yeah, he's no, a he's big yeah. emotion. That, that's that's <laughs> why. That's why you see men. That's why you see men turn around and slaughter their whole family because yeah. they've given their all to that woman. Yeah, yeah. So you're right. That's, a good point. <laughs> that's a little extreme. Hey, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Slaughter with a dog.